Hey guys, this is a shout out to all the labs that are joined us and uh, are making the shields with us. Let's make one lakh shields together. But however, this video is a safety video to show you how to keep your labs safe and uh, make sure uh, no viruses from outside get inside. So this is what we have done. We uh, suggest you to follow the same. When people come in, no matter who it is, first thing first, ask them to remove their shoes and bags outside the lab itself. So in our case, we are making sure that everyone uh, removes their shoes and bags outside. So that's including myself, no shoes uh, and bags, anything that's coming from outside, outside. Next, step two, first thing, they go straight to the toilet and wash their hands and faces as well. So hands and faces both are super duper important. You have to make sure there is nothing on your hands and faces. Legs is also a great idea, but let's start with hands and faces. Uh, make sure there is enough soap at your lab and uh, uh, maybe request them to go all the way to the elbow in case the hands are kind of open. So in your case, just go a little further. In the case it's covered, it should be all right. Uh, once you're done with that, the next thing that uh, then I'll come back to it one second. Uh, the next thing after they're done washing their hands and faces properly, which in case case is done, the next thing, all the phones, water bottle, watches, anything that they bring from outside needs to be with alcohol and use some uh, tissue paper, sanitize it, make sure all the germs on top of that is dead. Second give them fresh masks each. So even masks from outside is not a good idea. Give your own masks, keep your own masks, make sure that everyone carries and takes a new mask. Do not hold the mask from here. Hold the mask only from the elastic when holding the mask and passing it on to somebody else. Okay, the next thing. Uh, after that, another precaution that we're taking, uh, well, it's not for uh, not very important, but at the same time, very, very advisable because the shields, we're making everyone wear a shield inside, including myself. All of us are wearing our own shields. Reason being one, we can test them and we can make sure what we're giving out to the hospitals is foolproof and not breaking. Second, uh, everyone ends up protecting themselves while wearing these shields. So. Just give them the DIY kits. Here's your shield. You can write your name on it. Uh, there's a new OHP sheet. You can put that on. You can remove the paper and put that on. And here are the two strings to tie it up to the back. Okay, that's how you make people enter your lab. They should have the mask, they should have the shield, get their shoes outside, and uh, um, anything that they're bringing from outside to be outside, no bags inside this place, uh, phones, everything else that they're bringing inside should be sanitized. So that the main area, which in this case, the lab, always is safe because that's your first priority. Anything that you're making over here should not, You main idea is no matter what happens that but the shield that we're making should not infect any doctor. That's utmost priority. No doctor should fall sick because of us. Okay, let's go. Let's get making.